Wyndham men have sent their Big V Championship rivals a message with an emphatic 36-point defeat of Blackburn Vikings. Despite the magnitude of the success, coach Lucas Allen says there's still plenty of work to be done. Six double-digit scorers and a dominant win. But coach Lucas Allen's high expectations mean there's still scope for refinement in Wyndham's game. That's Cavion Green, Reese Howard. Maurice Howard, bang! For three. We've got seven games left before playoff start, um, and we've been building on the defensive side of the ball, which I think for the most part we did a pretty good job tonight. Uh, offensively it was a bit clunky, but we still put up 100 and something points, so not too dissatisfied with that, but there's plenty of work for us to do. It's the second win in a row after late May saw the region's Premier Hoops outfit drop consecutive games to Sunbury Jets and Hume Broncos. Yeah, I think it was a time and a lesson. Um, I think we got the big head. We started getting complacent after we won all those games in a row. And I think those two losses helped us in uh, bringing us back together and focusing more and, and looking at the task at hand. Alan welcomed the Polish and Howard's game. His 28-minute contribution producing 15 points with 12 coming from outside the arc. For three, it's good and one. And one of the things we're trying to work lately is the rotations and getting good lineups on the floor and consistent lineups. And I think it's not really quite nailed it with Reese, but he did a hell of a job. Like, I mean, the guy can score at three levels, defends, he's a leader out on the floor. Um, there's a reason that he's putting up the numbers across the season that he does because, man, the boy can play. The Florida native nice. relished watching teammates it. rise to the occasion. Kenny Gorski straight into his work. So they try to focus in on one guy and try to take me out of it. So luckily and happily, most of our players stepped up today and contributed well. Kevin Green led all comers with 18 points at 54%, while also ripping down nine boards and providing four assists. Rising star Aaron Dolney continued his affection for three-point shooting. Dolney, corner three. Yes, Aaron Dolney. Back to back. And Keenan Gorski demonstrated just why he is rated so very highly by his Keenan coach. Gorski. Keenan can shoot, right? And the uh, thing with him, he's also got a fairly good IQ. So he makes good reads off the ball as well. Um, defensively, he's actually surprised us here this year. He's able to probably guard two to four. Um, uses his size to his advantage, but also has decent feet. Um, and for Keenan, like, he's done a great job this year. Like, we've, he's good enough to start in any team in the league, including ours, but he's been coming off the bench and just provides that just constant scoring threat. Um, coming off the bench for us, which is great. Wyndham's ability to score on turnovers was just one of the keys to the runaway success. One thing we do try to work towards is generating turnovers before they shoot the ball so we can get out and run. Um, and I mean, that's a big part of what we do at practice, big part of what we do every game. Um, the guys were pretty good with that tonight. While Howard was full of praise for the list assembled under the watch of Coach Allen. So he did a great job at that, at that I feel like, uh, bringing in me and KG and then surrounding us with a great team, with the players from inside the city, for the most part, yes sir. This AL for three is good. Wes Cusworth, Wyndham News.